Coming up on Dystopia Daily. <laughs> Did you feed your grandma Play-Doh? Why do I feel like this is 11 fetishes combined into one experience? <laughs> You're not the main character! <laughs> Content! <laughs> That's what she said. Hi, I'm Dan and welcome back to Dystopia Daily because every day on the internet we're reminded of how social media slowly kills our brain cells until you're like me with one lonely sphere bumping around an empty cold cave. It is once more time where I actually try participating in the culture of this website and just make some regular, relatable, reactionary content to just try and get over it. This is S-A-W-Y-D. Some shit a YouTuber would do. I can't fucking read. <laughs> One of my favorite kinds of YouTube videos that I watch all the time, but we never dare post on main is straight up reacting to funny TikToks. And I love this shit, okay? When I sit down to watch a YouTuber, and you know, it's just, it's your YouTuber with that sense of humor you like, laughing along with some clips. It's like, you're just in voice chat with a friend. It's warm, it's cozy, it's casual. It is unoriginal, uninspired, lazy, plagiarative, pointless content. <laughs> Let's do it. I asked you guys to send me your fave funniest TikTok, so as well as being an indicator of your taste level, this is on you. If I like what I see, I can like it, and then you can help save my desperately default algorithm and make this shit chaotic. Now, as I'm sure you've realized by now, uh, something I'm a fan of is trying to dress up some simple shit with a theme to try and make it look more creative than it actually is. Hi. So, just reacting to some funny videos. No, hey, why not make it a challenge where you try not to laugh? Now look, here's the thing about try not to laugh videos. If the appeal is watching a YouTuber react, and the whole point of try not to laugh is to not react, surely you're just watching someone's face cover half of a fucking TikTok. Now, okay, someone genuinely trying not to crack, especially with a forefoot on the line can be fun, but I personally, just can't believe it is that hard to not laugh. So you want a challenge? How's this? Um, if you laugh, <laughs> you lose. If I laugh, I instantly die. I will just fucking die right here on this couch and decompose next to my buddy here and you can all react to my fucking funeral. How's that? Wheelbarrow of tomatoes. Right, life's on the line. Here we go. <clears throat> Next. <laughs> Bro, I got the loudest coffee maker in the world. Watch how loud this shit is. Did you feed your grandma Play-Doh? How many times did I have to- <laughs> Stop throwing the rock. <sighs> Stop the brick roll. Mom, what the fuck did you just do? And lastly. Whatever daddy wants, daddy gets. Wow, I'm still here. Well, there we go. Sorry to disappoint you. Can I actually just enjoy the videos now? Fun challenge! <sighs> but for real, what the fuck was that one in the middle? Um, I'm just gonna have to revisit that for a second because I just want to enjoy my life. Bro, I got the loudest coffee maker in the world. Watch how loud this shit is. Did you feed your grandma Play-Doh? How many times did I have to- <laughs> Would you rob yourself from the joy of being able to experience whatever the fuck just happened in that? Okay, let's react. But first, a word from today's sponsor. <sighs> Alright, what's the plan? Am I just sponsoring myself again? Jesus Christ, this is so depressing. We actually got a sponsor. Wait, we actually ha we have a real sponsor? Oh, <laughs> cool. Who is it? Is it uh, Apple? 
Balenciaga, Pringles, NordVPN. Actually, like, un unironically, I'm going to sponsor NordVPN. Okay. I mean, you did buy an entire skeleton, so. <laughs> Hi! When I'm trying to hide what I do online, because I'm a sussy bussy, I use NordVPN. <laughs> Having a virtual private network is perfect for me right now as I'm on tour through the USA, because I can set my location back to Britain and access Phil's Netflix account to be a cheap ass and binge watch The Office from the start so I can pretend I'm friends with Jim and Pam instead of, you know, prioritizing my own needs. It's perfect for anyone who doesn't like the idea of ad trackers getting to know you, or if you don't want your ISP to spy on your poor... 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 Goose streamers. It's available on so many platforms. Windows, Android, iOS, Linux. Linux? <laughs> Does anyone actually use Linux? Really? Okay. It's probably available on your Wi-Fi vibrator. And thanks to Dystopia Daily, this powerful tech company has a special offer just for you. Just head to my unique URL, which is on screen now. It is, uh, what's it is risk-free <laughs> with Nord's 30-day money-back guarantee. Okay, that was dirty. Oh God, you are not worth it. Don't film this. So just to clarify, um, I'm gonna like probably every single one of those. Goats just shoving shit in their mouth. Yeah, sure, home interior malfunctions. Coffee machine with the Pikachu rug and the Rick roll. And what is... This is why I need your help. Okay, why is it a 50 year old man squealing and looking at Harry Bow? Why? Okay, right, no, but here's like, for real. Why, why would I want, why would anyone want to see that? Let's react. Okay, let's get cozy, let's just hang out. I'm just with you, sat, I was about to say in bed, that's fucking weird, made it weird. Um, I'm sat on the floor, across from you. I'm just, I'm not, I'm, this is a YouTube video, let's stop making it fucking crazy, right? Let's react. What did they call Aladdin when he went vegan? Saladin. <laughs> okay, jelly shot. <laughs> okay, that was like a whole in and out experience of one man's digestive system. <laughs> well, we learned one thing that this guy can't do, and that's on the internet now. And you're wondering how the back of his throat works with those dangly things. <laughs> we got our answer. <laughs> Hank, what? <laughs> you know, I was complaining about my last brain cell. That was it. It's kind of this is the kind of shit where it's like, what what speaks to you emotionally and spiritually? Just that. I don't need a seven hour video essay about someone's fucking trauma. Just give me whatever the fuck that was. Let the dolls. All right. Okay, that is two broken vaginas right there. Good for you. I had dolls when I was a kid. I went to Woolworths and there was like an, an action man Jeep or a Barbie in a bikini. And I bought the Barbie in the bikini. And then my mum had this moment when she was like, is that when I should have known you were gay? And actually it was because I already had an action man and I just didn't want action man to be lonely. I was just buying a heteronormative companion for my action man. So it wasn't gay, it was just sad. Eating hydration with no hands. Eating. See, I feel like this guy is just waterboarding himself, right? Where is this going? You know, there is an irony here that this is a bottle of smart water. <clears throat> Why is he making the fucking sexual noise? Why do I feel like this is 11 fetishes combined into one experience? Oh my God, why is this so long? I'm so uncomfortable. <clears throat> Well, there we go. Um, yeah, I'm gonna spend about 19 hours on Pornhub trying to explore all the things that that awakened in me. Dang okay. it. Can you grab me a napkin? Yeah, I can get you a napkin. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> See, is, it worth, is the property destruction worth it? Is the assault worth it? Why? Thanks. There's your TikTok. Oh my god! 
Is that a piano? I did not Why even is this me? Why right? am I about to be personally yeah, attacked? To oh, yeah. that's so okay. cool. So Anyways, long ago, I, saying, I don't even remember yeah. how, like, as I, don't I was know saying, where I was starting. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, yes, okay. <laughs> I don't do that. What I do is I wait for just, you know, those interstitial moments where maybe someone's doing the dishwasher, someone's come out of the shower, and then I'll just start really loudly busting out fur release, and they'll be like, do you play the piano? I go, no, no, I don't, that's fine. I was just practicing something. Stop laughing, because you know that's what I did yesterday. I'm going thotting, plotting, yep. and trotting. Okay. Don't be going around with your butt cheeks hanging out. Whole life or no Leave life. me the fuck alone. Why does this have 2,000 likes? One left. This, whatever this is right now, this sets the tone for the rest of your life. I, I could have said day there, but here we go. Everyone wants a peanut butter? No, yeah. not this. I know, I've seen this. <laughs> I don't want to see it. I don't want to see it. I know what this is and I don't want to see it. And they, they know they don't want to show it. This is in there with the ass. <laughs> It's not worth it. It's not worth it for the content. Have some goddamn dignity. You don't want to end up like me. Now, here's the test. I just liked every single one of those TikToks and I'm now gonna refresh my algorithm for the first time. No, it's dancing, it's da- Why are they dancing? No one on the train wants to see you dancing. They're just trying to get to work. You're not the main character, for fuck's sake. <laughs> but for real, um, it seems like I need to do another 11,000 of these to just not get unironic dancing on weird 50 year old men making child noises. Welcome to TikTok. Well look, I wanted this to help and clearly it hasn't worked yet, but honestly I'm scared to wake up tomorrow and see what the algorithm shows me after this total corruption. But uh, if you want to see me on your preferred 3am doom scrolling app of choice. Oh, okay, you can follow me on fucking TikTok again. Mm. Where you can expect this. Thanks, Phil. Now nobody's showering on the bus. <laughs> Hello, Internet. It's me, Dan, your favorite sarcastic self deprecating Really? Now, see, I enjoyed doing that. I had fun. But do I want to do it every single day? What do you think? I want to see a violent civil war in the comments. If I just start streaming this content and post eight videos a day and Dan is not interesting, or if you'd rather I just quietly disappear, have some other inevitable kind of breakdown and come back in two years with a three hour video essay about how my daddy issues made me move to Brazil and live with a belly man in a shack. So what other kind of content would you like me to be curious about? Find out next time if I don't just delete my channel on S-S-A-Y-W-D.